You have chosen a beautiful young lady as your bride, and I could not be happier to officially welcome Asta Flynn to our family today. Asta, marriage made you part of our family, and love made you my daughter. Asta is truly special in every way, and I thank God that he gave her to all of us. May you both know unspeakable joy. May you experience love that is bountiful. May your provisions always be plentiful. May God be ever merciful, abundantly blessing you with health, wealth, and wisdom. Just a moment ago, I thought of you and my heart was filled with gratitude. So before another moment passes, I want to take this time to thank you. Thank you for bearing with the distance in our relationship and supporting me through my masters. Thank you for being the person I could turn to whenever there was trouble and for listening to me vent. Thanks for making this chaotic and crazy year feel like a breeze and with getting me late night desserts, going on long drives and getting me soup dumplings. Thank you for encouraging me to try and even when I failed, being proud of me. Thanks for being the best travel buddy, exploring new places with me and sharing the same passion for yummy food. I hope that wherever we end up, we will continue to grow and respect each other. Dear Asta, from what others tell me, it is normal to feel anxious before getting married, but I have never been more confident in any decision than when I asked for your hand in marriage. Even back in India, I had no trepidations concerning our union or what the future holds, and what an adventure the past year and a half has been. I shudder to think about how much less I would have accomplished without your constant support, pushing me to take risks and proactively seek projects and opportunities outside my comfort zone. I could not have reaped today's rewards without your guidance, drive, and nourishment. Every day has been a reminder of why I fell in love with you in the first place. The confidence and gumption you exhibit in your approach to every task, mundane or complex, is inspiring. Truly, you are the greatest thing that has ever happened to me. From the moment we met, I was innately drawn to you by an elusive, prima facie unknown feeling. This feeling drew us towards one another in Indianapolis and motivated me to carry through all of the gin and tonics you persuaded me to drink. It is the feeling that kept us tethered through multiple years of a long distance relationship. It is the feeling that kept our relationship strong through the joys of India and the subsequent uncertainty of a year long pandemic. We now know that this feeling is, of course, love. Baruchim habaim b'shem Adonai, blessed are you who have come here in the name of God. Ibedu et Adonai b'simcha ba'u l'fana b'irnana, serve Adonai with joy, come into God's presence with song. We rejoice that Noah and Asa join in marriage in the presence of God and loved ones. Ve'eras tikli. Le'olam. Le'olam. Ve'eras tikli. Ve'eras tikli. V'tzedek. V'tzedek. U'v'mishpat. U'v'mishpat. Uve chesed. Uve shefed. Uve chesed. Uve chesed. Hef chesed. Uve rachamin. Uve rachamin. Ve eras tichli. Ve eras tichli. Ve emuna. Ve emuna. Ve adata. Ve adata. Et adonai. Et adonai. I betroth you to me forever. I betroth you to me forever. I betroth you to me. I betroth you to me. With steadfast love. With steadfast love. And compassion. And compassion. I betroth you to me. I betroth you to me. In faithfulness. In faithfulness. Our lives together are nourished by the truth that genuine friendship is the source of vibrant and everlasting love. We promise to be honest and gentle, anticipating our milestones, celebrating our successes, honoring our uniqueness and striving to paint the future with confident strokes of kindness. Our love forever will be an inspiration to family, friends and others who are or will be in love. We are trust honored caretakers and we will delight in an elegant freedom born from mutual respect. Our laughter, sparkling, is our song. 
Its melody will fill our home and color our memories. We will remember why we fell in love. Our sacred covenant is valid and binding. If I forget you, O Jerusalem, let my right hand forget her cunning. Let my right hand forget her cunning. Let my tongue cleave to the roof of my mouth. Let my tongue cleave to the roof of my mouth. If I remember thee not, if I remember thee not, if I set not Jerusalem, if I set not Jerusalem above my highest joy, above my highest joy. I truly love you from the bottom of my heart and would not want to share this life with anyone else. And Asa, I love you. Yours for seven lifetimes, together, Noah.